Hi, welcome to Uniquely Yours Crochet Podcast Vlogmas 2023. And yes, I know it's been a long time, y'all. Um, too long. I haven't really felt up to recording in a while, and um, I had the vid. I went on vacation. Um, all the things have happened <laughs> um, outside of um, dealing with some chronic pain issues. However. I decided to challenge myself and get back in the game for Vlogmas 2023. So happy Vlogmas, um, Merry Advent, all the things. Um, first day of Vlogmas, I am about to head into Bath and Body Works for Candle Day to see um, what I can see. It is raining, um, so I wore my... Uh, hooded crossbody cow um cousins crossbody the remix by um <laughs> by our cousin ruby baby over at love and every stitch by ruby baby so i wore that today um this is a finished object for the week actually and so that's what i'm going to be doing for vlogmas i am going to be showing you guys um objects that i finished recently or not so recently um I have a lot of things to show so i'll be popping in um to show you guys some things every day uh could be some purchases could be i don't know we'll see but i am challenging myself to do vlogmas this year um so i've missed you guys i hope that you tune in um i'll be back a little later so the next clip you'll see is me at home kind of showing you some more finished objects but right now i'm about to go head out in the rain um but today is preview day for those who are rewards members so i don't have to stand in line tomorrow and that's a good thing all right talk to you guys later okay y'all is it me or do you absolutely hate when the one thing you go into a store for they do not have sweater weather how do you not have a million sweater weather candles on hand for candle day hey welcome back okay so i'm home and before it gets too dark i wanted to go ahead and record some of the objects i want to show you okay so first thing is a grinch hat that i made myself and i will link the pattern below it's a youtube tutorial with like a waffle stitch but i got the idea for the grinch hats from lisa at happy to hook and so i ordered lime green pom-poms and i used big twist red white and the color slime to make my hat so it's a little slouchy this one's mine i made a few um for my inventory um in a different pattern which is I'll show you on another day, but this one's mine. And so it's a waffle stitch. So cute. I have fun with the pattern. Wanted to try something different. And so I did. Um, removable pom pom. I attached it with a button and um, ordered it off of Etsy. And I will link the seller below too if I can remember. Next hat I made for myself is a gray and blue lion's bucket hat. If you follow me on Instagram or Facebook, you already saw it. Um, go lions, we're having a really good season. And um, so I made a couple lions items, sold one set um, and made another um, hat. I haven't made the matching scarf yet, but I will. It's in the works. So those two are for me. So here's some items I made for my inventory. More hats. I made a chunky hat. Um, I ordered this yarn on the Premier Black Friday sale. Got it. Uh, must have been this weekend because I ordered way before Black Friday and it came super fast. Um, and so this was a ball of the um, sweet roll chunky cake or bulky cake. I, I have to check. Um, and ordered pom-poms off of Amazon. Thought that one went pretty well. Um, 
this was a YouTube tutorial as well. I believe it's MJ off the hook, but I could be wrong. So I'm going to find it and link it in the um, description box below. Of course, I don't color control, so I let it do what it's going to do. That's for inventory. This was another one. Oh, look at those colors, y'all. It reminds me of the Red Heart Pom Pom or Bon Bon yarn. Um, the colors that are in that, if you, uh, the Super Saver. But this is also Premier, super soft. Um, it reminds me of a tre treasure shawl. It's for my inventory. And last one that I'm going to show today. And that's this one. Isn't that cute? Again, these tutorials are all YouTube tutorials. This one and this one is the same tutorial. Um, I love it, actually. It's really stretchy. And um, pom-poms are snap-on from Amazon. And this one... I don't know. These might be gifts. Even though I said that they're inventory, I have so much inventory because I thought that I would be doing holiday craft shows or markets um, this season and I didn't get accepted to any of the ones um, that I applied for, mostly because crochet is very popular and there are a lot of crochet artists who do markets. And so if you're not on top of it, you're going to miss out. So I have a lot of inventory. So these actually might be gifts. Um, because and I love them so much and I'm so tempted to keep them for myself. Last thing I want to show is in the, staying in the Grinch theme. This is for inventory. This is a Grinch crossbody cowl. I did it in the candy cane red and white with the lime green trim. This is a uh, super bulky uh, basic from Premier. This is also Love and Every Stitch by Ruby Baby, the original original crossbody cowl. This isn't a plus size one. I made this exactly like the pattern with the size um, 10 millimeter hook. The one that I have on, which y'all yeah, got to get into it. I made it plus size, so I used the 11.5 millimeter hook. Y'all, yeah. yes. The girl can design her butt off, okay? Love it. Anywho, I'm in the middle of making a second um, hooded one in uh, other colors that I will show once it's done. I got to sew it up. But yes, this one I did a Grinch themed one. This is for inventory and or maybe a gift for someone because I want someone to get use out of it since it's Grinch themed. Um, if you're interested in it, private message me. <laughs> um, but yeah, so all of these and that were for inventory this and this was for me so i'll be wearing this throughout the holiday season because yes i'm all about grinch i have a grinch uh, sweatshirt that i wear while i'm doing um these videos and things like that um i made a grinch bucket hat there's so much i want to show you guys so there's a lot of days in vlogmas haha <laughs> so this one um Ooh, it's going to be a long one anyway, so I'm going to head out. Thanks for joining me um, for day one of Vlogmas 2023. I will see you tomorrow, uh, Lord willing. Um, just want to leave you with the season. A lot of people may not celebrate, and that's fine, but I believe that this is a time to reflect and prepare for the coming of our Lord and Savior um, as we prepare to celebrate his birth. I know for a fact that this isn't the that isn't the exact day he was born. However, it's the true the day I declare um, his day of birth that I celebrate and give praise for that. And so, as I reflect and just am grateful for that gift to um, humanity, that gift of grace and salvation, I pray um, that even if this year has been rough, as it has been for a lot of us, that we use this season just to reflect on something that we are grateful for and thankful for. And um, I will see you tomorrow, Lord willing. God loves you and so do I.